Good morning! Excited because we got the backdrop for the girls' party. I ordered this on Etsy. I bought four sheets. It's really meant for like photographers, but since the room that we're using, like it's kind of, it's just plain colors and dull. And I was actually looking for a princess backdrop, but then I decided on this because it's generic and we can use it for other events. It looks like Mia's gonna be cooking! What are you gonna cook? Ooh, hey, does it go on top of the ice cream cone? Yeah, I'll put it on top. Ice cream. There you go. Good job, Mia. Why? Come on, girls, come on. Walk to mommy. Walk to mommy. Oh, <laughs> what are you kissing the wall for, huh? Come on. Oh, yes. She's been walking back and forth in the kitchen. You got it, Mia. Come on, Mia. <laughs> For some reason, she's walking on the side. I don't know why. Why don't you walk right behind it? Yay! Okay, let's turn around. We'll give you more fig newtons. Oh, there she goes! There she goes! We just got off a Skype call for with a network, and I, I know already I'm not allowed to talk about it, but um, it's kind of exciting. It's totally in the baby steps, so something could come out of it, something may not come out of it, so we're not even gonna say anything yet, but. Anyways, I was just curious for all the other dads out there because I just saw the video that Judy put up yesterday of the vlog us playing with the girls at the dining room table and how goofy I am. It's so natural for me to be goofy for the girls because I want to make them laugh and like make them happy, right? Even including Judy. I was curious if there are any other dads that are goofy like that or if that's just something that that's unique to me. I think there's other dads out there that are also like that. They just I'm act trying to goofy. think. Like my dad wasn't goofy with me. Like he's 
he's goofy like when we're at social functions but with like my sister and I he was never really goofy like when you're young even yeah like, you... I know no because my dad was gone a lot in the military so it was it was just me and my mom and my grandparents the crazy thing with Benji is that you see how goofy he is in the vlogs but if you know him personally, he is totally not that. He is yeah. actually a very serious person. You guys get a different side of me <laughs> it's so that I don't show in you like, don't my business in life or no. in yeah. I, I guess and even it's in funny some... because even our friends would be like, "Wow, Benji on the vlog." Yeah. Well, I only this is the thing. I'm only like that for Judy and the I, I love it. He, Benji's goofy with me. Yeah. But. Outside of just family, he's very serious. He, I'm, he's I'm more reserved and I'm definitely to conservative. Totally reserved. Yeah. Like, he has his poker face on all day, every day. We're going to have to show your parents. Baby. Kira just took like six steps. It was so cute. We got it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh, look at you, girl. Look at you, girl. Mia's hugging the cat. <laughs> I'm just gonna put these randomly up against the wall at the party, but we just printed these out. Me and Kira's pictures. Oh, is that plate quite delicious? Oh, thank you. Um, this looks like you. Do you like that photo? This looks like you. Yeah, it's Mia. I'm so beautiful. You're yeah, beautiful. Oh, gonna... oh, thanks for throwing it everywhere. Honey, look at these pictures. Oh. Ooh, do you remember this? This is when they were in their oh um, that bouncy thingy. And they slept together still. Yeah, so I hard like that to get picture right there. Where's that? That was in Missouri. Oh, I like that one. Oh wait. Yeah. yeah. Oh, which baby is this? Mia. Yeah. This one's so cute of Mia. Oh, yeah. wait, let me show you guys the cute one of Kira. Well, all of them are cute. I mean, come on this now. This looks like Benji. This, this looks one? This like old picture of you. Yeah. Cool. This one is a really cute one Because I feel like there's a picture on that exact blanket. So, Do are you okay that she's it. like sitting on them? Yeah! Oh, so close! <laughs> Alright. Here, you try and walk. Okay, go ahead and keep it. <laughs> <laughs> She has to you know what? Everyone. She's she's using the um the cart. Come. She walks a lot with the cart. Come on, Mia. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's go walk to your cart. <laughs> there you. Oops. Oh. Woohoo! Go, Mia. Yeah, she likes that for now. Come on, Kira. Come on. Oh, see you, Mia. <laughs> see you guys. Gonna go shopping. Walk back to mommy. Come on, come on, Mia. Who? Andy Grammer. I haven't heard of him. Oh, you would know his songs if you've heard them. Andy Grammer. He has a new song called "Honey, I'm Good," and I'm a little obsessed. With him. Oh. <laughs> Just keep going to nowhere. Okay, no, one gonna eat this chicken bacon? no, that one's just left over. We're finally gonna try the tan that Loving Tan sent me from Australia, and Auntie Val's gonna be my tan model. So I think we're gonna go for. You know what? We tried medium on her, and it was really light because we tried it the other day, and you can't see it at all. So I think we're gonna go for dark, natural olive color. <laughs> I checked the Instagram just to make sure if using dark on Val would be okay. The results are pretty cool. I mean, this is on their Instagram. 
I hope these are real people. <laughs> and it looks like she went tanning at the beach. Yeah. And that would take about three months for me to <laughs> Okay, so here's Val's before, and hopefully it's still oh, sunny in like an hour. Anyway, we have all of the party stuff here. I'm so excited. Two more days! So I did Val's right leg, and holy cow, your right leg went to Hawaii or something. <laughs> <laughs> that is crazy. It was kind of hard putting um, the stuff on. Like, I was really scrubbing. <laughs> What was that, like two layers of product? Yeah. I think be. it was two. That is so crazy. Oh yeah, that is a scratch on my leg. Out here you can see it way better because of the lighting. I couldn't tell. Did you just shot. come back from California? I did. Or your legs? <laughs> I sent my legs there. <laughs> we ended up just doing her legs because we oh noticed some like blotchy my parts. But then again, here. she didn't exfoliate. But it looks amazing. You look like Victoria's Secret legs. Singing. Yeah, I've never heard the song before. I think this is the new song. Wait, what other songs does he sing? What's his name again? Andy Grammer. Andy Grammer. I have no idea who he is. But then again, I never knew who Ellie Goldberg. Ellie Golding. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I didn't know who she was. But I've heard her songs before, yeah. but it wasn't until Fifty Shades of Grey. I'm just so not in tune with today's music, like today's artists, unless you're Taylor Swift and Beyonce and... <laughs> well, technically they're not really today's artists. They were like from... Yeah, they've been around for a while. For a long time. But new artists, I don't know. I Other like than Sam Smith. I love Sam Smith music. So I am doing a review on a foundation today. I've been wearing it for how many hours? Like, <laughs> yeah, like four hours. Still, stay still. Stay still. Don't move, oh man. Okay, sit. So stay still. <laughs> I'll stay still. Hey, hey. stay still. What's that? A nutcracker? No, this is a, um, what do you call these? Like, uh, hand tool? Relief? I forgot what you call these, but it's supposed to make me stronger because I can lift more weight with my hands. Because sometimes the ball slips. Oh. the bathroom and nearly had a heart attack because I walk in and this is what I see I thought I mean, you, you don't even want to know what I thought but it freaked me out Benji's trying to fix his pants because I accidentally dried his pants in the dryer and it shrunk them I'm like in a hurry doing laundry I know it's Benji's 5'4 jeans and he was like really bummed out so he's like, I'm not kidding you, this is what Benji did last night. He wore his jeans, not only for like two hours, but he went in the tub with his jeans so he could kind of stretch it out. And then he hung it last night, which now it's, oh, it's still kind of wet. Hello. <laughs> How was Juliana? Were you three hours sleep? What? Too heavy? So much fun here. Here. Did you have so much fun here? Yes. Hey, kiss Papa. Hey, what, is, what are these? Orange. Did you have fun at Mama and Papa's? Yeah. Many, many years ago, when I first started doing like freelance makeup. I had this palette that I loved and I used it all the time 
from Senna Cosmetics, and it's the neutrals one. And this was like easily maybe like seven or six years ago. And then I went to a gig and then I left it there by accident. And the girl was so sweet. She's like, oh yeah, you left your palette, but they lived so far away and it's like, I just never got it back. When I went to purchase it again, they didn't sell it anymore and I was so bummed out. And for some reason, I think maybe I saw an ad or something. I went back on the website and they have it in stock. So then I bought it right away. And it's just, it's seriously the perfect palette for neutrals. Oh, and Whoa. remember that company I told you? It's called Hi. Dress Up. They sent me this cardigan. It's like a kimono Whoa. cardigan. Oh my goodness, Kira is so happy to see at the JB. Her face lit up when we picked her up. Daddy should be Little Mermaid. Yummy, thank you, Daddy. Thank you, Daddy. It smells really good. <laughs> Hallelujah! No, Daddy. No, Daddy. Comment of the day is to everybody because I have had such an overwhelming response from yesterday's video and everybody has been so supportive and encouraging. I was reading for like a good half hour to 45 minutes straight all your guys comments and I started crying all over again reading your stories and this is so amazing that we're able to share our thoughts and our feelings and just know that we're not alone. Uh, I'm gonna wrap up the vlog today which is a little earlier than usual, but I just want to spend time with the family. So uh, tomorrow's really exciting. It's Friday, and we have a lot of family from out of town coming for the girls' birthday party. So you'll get to see all of them. I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye. There's a story of a girl named Mia. She's the sweetest little girl, and she has a Bear is such a sweetie. She's just as adorable as Mia. But wait, there is another, and her name is Juliana Bear. JB Bear. Wait, no, no. Juliana Bear. She's active and crazy and loud, but she is sweet. And her sisters, and we miss her. Seriously a character.